everybody. It's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls, and this is our daily card reading for October 1st, 2021. Please make sure that you watch the weekly video. And of course, if you would like to come get a personal reading or an Akashic Records reading, please note that in your submission form, Akashic Records reading, if that's what you want. Because I don't have an option up for that, but you know, just note that. Uh, go to angelsouls444.com. Of course, I do still have all the meditation challenges over at gumroad.com slash angelsouls. So get the card for today. Believe in the impossible blue moon. I, I feel like this is the state that we're in. We think that peace is impossible. We think we're never going to get there. And so in some way we've given up and we just don't try anymore. Or if you feel like, you know, there's no getting through to certain people. The, there are a lot of issues with how people are, how shall I say, bringing their families together or creating families. So this, okay, so we'll get back to this believe in the impossible here in just a moment, but it feels like people are having children for the wrong reasons. Um, not, you know, women not taking care of their bodies during pregnancy and they're not taking care of themselves because they have not addressed their issues, their, um, patterns, you know, whatever's leading them to maybe drink during pregnancy or whatever. They're not looking at that. And so that gets passed on to the child. And now maybe the child feels like mommy and daddy's attentions are pulled away and they're not being cared for or whatever the deal is. Again, check with an expert on that. But definitely kids are not being treated the way that they deserve to be treated. And then they become adults who are not able to handle this world or they become I want to be careful with the words. Um, they become somebody who, they become perpetrators. All right. So we got to watch that and, and start seeing where we can bring more peace and harmony. How can we be more careful with the children? That's where it starts. Okay. We have to be careful with children. Now, does that, listen, <laughs> you can end up being a narcissist because your parents didn't teach you that you weren't the center of the universe. I mean, there are a lot of ways that we got to be balanced here, right? We want to be balanced, make sure kids are cared for, but they're not coddled, right? Okay, fine. So believe in the impossible does say that we have a chance here to overcome these humanitarian crises. Um, we can start by not putting uh, certain heartless, conniving, manipulative people uh, on a pedestal. When we start honoring people who can honor fellow human beings, can you imagine? Can you imagine if you had a boss that actually cared about you? Some of you do. Some of you will be like, no, that is my boss. My boss is awesome. Um, but I tell you what, again, I could write a whole book on my experiences just between LA and the movie industry and the corporate world in New York City. I could write a whole book about these maniacal um uh, to me, they are the zombie apocalypse. They are. They're like heartless, absolutely heartless, not caring if people suffer. Uh, it's all about the bottom line and money and success and looking like you have power and all that. So if we start disconnecting from that and saying, we're not going to honor that anymore. And we want to do better, but not in this pretentious way. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> we see a lot of that too, where it's like, you know, the way I live is perfect and you're cruel if you do this. You're cruel if you, you know, whatever, I'm not going to get into it, but, <laughs> but you know, I'm better than you because I live a cleaner life. Can, can we stop being so polarized, especially in our solutions? Because I think it's causing more problems and it's causing more pain. We don't need more of that. All right. So again, the harmony, the balance, finding grace within us. And being the expression of that without enabling. All right. So we're going to leave it there, guys. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.